it's gonna be a haul from Sephora and actually I got this stuff when I was in Italy in June or July something like that I don't really remember I didn't use this stuff I just got them out like two weeks ago to test them so I can make kind of a haul and a review but before I start I want to give a big shout out to my friend Stella who works in Sephora and she actually helped me to pick all of this stuff and she was very generous and amazing she's such an amazing person and she gave me all of this stuff for free and I'm gonna show you this um, at the end of this video so thank you so much Stella and actually my mom is in Italy now I called my Stella and asked her to pick some stuff from me from Sephora and my mom went and picked them up so she's such an amazing person thank you so much again so let's get started first I want to talk about some kind of gorgeous this is in deep and supposedly it's a foundation it's called foundation faker looks like this and it's very dark they only have two shades like light and deep I guess and what I can say about this actually I'm wearing it today on looks very oily in the pan but it's not it's very light consistency and it's not a foundation for me it doesn't have a full coverage or even medium coverage it's, just, it's very light coverage so I would I don't suggest you buy this if you if you need a foundation if you have a lot of foundations and you want to try something out this is a nice um, kind of a tinted foundation like for summer or if you don't want to wear a lot of makeup as I said I'm wearing it today and it's very nice it's dark and it gives like a tan color so I don't know I'm not really sure about this I've been using this for the past two weeks I love it but I'm not like crazy in love with it it doesn't have full coverage as I said next I want to talk about the custom powder cover-up and it's called hello flawless I got my shade in hazelnut what's cool about this it has 15 SPF and it's a very nice consistency it's so powdery and it's very thick I don't know if you can see I have it on today to set like my foundation you can use this as like a powder foundation it's very good I didn't break out so far from it so I like it. next I got the erase paste and this is a concealer I got mine in number three deep they have three shades light medium and deep um actually I got this because I heard a lot of girls raving about it here on YouTube but honestly I'm not impressed at all the consistency is very weird and it just makes my my under eye area looks hectic and tired I don't know maybe the the shade is too dark for my skin but this is something I don't like about Benefit they don't have like a lot of variety so you can uh, get your perfect match and also it comes with this weird scoop that I don't know what you should do with it so I don't know I'm not really impressed also I got the Boeing concealer I got this in number two and this one I like looks like this I also have it on like on top of uh, erase paste looks like this it's a very nice consistency it doesn't crease and it looks good I had no problem whatsoever with this concealer actually I like it also I got the lemonade which is a color correcting and eyelid primer actually I've been using this for the past week or two and I've been loving this it's so nice the consistency is amazing it doesn't crease it covers up all my redness and all my veins on my eyelid it's just amazing I really really like this I totally recommend you go check it out it's one of the best um, eye primers that I ever use also I got the powder flash and basically that's like a powder concealer you apply it uh, on top of your concealer and it makes your under eye area looks brighter and I'm wearing it today actually I like it it's nice Next I want to talk about this Speed Bro and this is a quick set bro gel. Looks like this and the color is kind of brown but when you apply it on any eyebrows it just looks transparent. I don't know if you can see but it looks transparent. This is basically to set your eyebrows. I've been using this lately and I love it. It's amazing. It works amazing. It doesn't make your um, eyebrows look like hard but it looks amazing and sets them very good and I'm wearing it today but excuse my eyebrows because I really have to do them but I don't have time next I got two eyeshadows and I really really like the packaging it looks like the Mew Mew design uh, the designer Mew Mew and first I got give me some plum which is this amazing purple uh, grayish color here's this watch and the next color I got is called where there's smoke and it's a very pretty olivey golden color that's what I'm wearing 
today. Next I got three of the Creaseless Cream Shadow Liner. It looks like this and supposedly this is like the paint pot. First one I got is Busy Signal. It's a very nice brownie color and that's a swatch, the first one. The next one I got is very very pretty and it's called Stiletto. It's a plump burgundy color and this is the second swatch. And the third one is the one I'm wearing under my eyeshadow and it's called Birthday Suit. And here's a swatch. It's very pretty. I heard a lot of girls saying that it creases on them, but actually I've been testing them. When I use them without a primer, they crease like no other. But a little tip for you is to apply primer before you apply this. It's not a paint pot. You cannot use it as a primer, as a base. You have to apply a primer, then use this as a cream shadow. Next I got the Chicha Tint and this is a mango tinted lip and cheek stain. Looks like this and I swatched it here for you. So looks like this when you apply it and then when you blend it, it gives this amazing orangey summery um, look. Next I got Moonbeam which is a very nice highlight. Um, that's how it looks like and that's when you blend it. It's very very nice like shiny, pinky, mauvey golden amazing highlight. Speaking of highlights I also got Girl Meets Peril and this is a very 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 nice highlight. It looks like this you twist it you get the product and it's a very very pretty color. I have it on today as a highlight. Just gives a very nice glow to your face. So that's that. Next I got four lip glosses and actually I'm really disappointed on these they're very very bad, they suck, they are not pigmented, they don't last, they stick, they're just nasty, I hate them. So here are some swatches, the first one is Dancing Queen, then Back to Fuchsia, then Who Are You Wearing, and the last one is the one that I really like and it's called uh, Spike Punch. And it's a coral matte color. I love this color. This is the only one that I've been using. And also I got two lipsticks. The first one I got, that's the one I'm wearing. It's called Lady Choice. It's a very nice, like, everyday nude color. And here's a swatch. I really like it. That's what I'm wearing on today. And the second one is called Pillow Talk. And it looks like this. It's more of like an orangey, reddish, hot pink. And here's a swatch. Also, I got this perfume and it's called So Hooked on Caramel. It smells so good. It's so sweetie, but it has like a little bit of spice. I've been wearing this lately and I love it. And last but not least from Benefit, I got this palette and it's called Sunday Fun Day. When you open it, you get like a humongous mirror and a small like pamphlet that tells you ways you can apply the eyeshadow and stuff. So it looks like this. It comes with two mini brushes and it comes with a um, mini brown pencil eyeliner and it comes with this shimmering lip gloss which is amazing and it's called shimmering rose and a mini like travel size of the bean tint oops looks like this and also it comes with mini uh, hula bronzer here and it comes with four eyeshadows and let me swatch them very fast for you guys so here's the swatches, very very pigmented and very very nice. I love this palette and I'm gonna be doing a tutorial very soon with this palette. So that's all I got from Benefit. I also picked up some stuff from Sephora. I got the Sephora Mineral Loose Powder Foundation. It looks like this and this is in number 36 tan. I didn't try it so I don't know. I also got the Sephora Pin Up Show number 13 palette and it looks like this. I love this shimmery burgundy color. Can't wait to wear this on Christmas. They're very, very pigmented. Also, I got the Sephora Blush Me Twice in number one. Basically, it's like a shimmery bronzer and a matte uh, like powder blush. And that's what I'm wearing on today. Very, very pretty and very pigmented. Also, I got this sculpting disc from Sephora. It's like a um, bronzer, powder, and a highlighter. And Andrea's Choice has this palette so I got it because of her 
Also, I picked up this uh, long-lasting eyeliner and it's in a burgundy color. It's like this color. It's very, very nice. Also, I got this um, eye glitter. It's a gel glitter. I don't own any gel glitter. Also, I got this like uh, set and it's called Night Spirit. It comes with five eyeshadows, Sweet Candy, Midnight Kiss, Made in Manhattan, Engagement Ring, and Swimming Pool. They're all very pigmented and the, the size is amazing. It's like tiny so I can take it with you. Also, I picked up two of the Daily Makeup Brush Cleanser. I wanted to try that. Next, I got a Yes to Cucumber Calming Facial Mask and it looks like this. I used this today in the morning and it works amazing. It's so, so nice and soft on the skin. Also, I got a backup for my Strivictin SD because I love this and I use it every single day. And if you don't know what is this, this is for stretch marks. It helps you to... Uh, remove your stretch marks or actually blend the stretch marks into your normal skin color. Also, I got this set from Strivictin SD and it's very small. It's like a trial set. And these are 0.75 fluid ounce. It comes with a scrub and it comes with the stretch marks and uh, wrinkles cream. And also it comes with an eye uh, concentrated for wrinkles. I didn't try them yet. But I think I'm gonna give this to my sister so she can try it and see if it works with her or not. And the last thing I got is this Lineless Foaming Cleanser. And this is anti-aging, antioxidant, dissolves makeup and impurities, non-striping. So it looks like this. And actually my friend Stella who works in Sephora recommended this for me. I didn't try it. I actually used it only once, but I love the consistency. So when you apply it, it looks like this. And then when you work it on your face, It turns into a foam so it's so cool I really want to start using it so see and it's so foamy and amazing so that's all the stuff I purchased with my own money then she gave me this big makeup bag from Sephora and it's full of gifts so first they gave me this yes to cucumber uh, facial towelettes which I don't like because they break me out so I'm gonna give this to my sister also I got this uh, buffer and it's like four step buffer from Sephora I really like this. Also, they gave me a full size from uh, Miss Dior Cherie. And as you can see, not for sale tester. So they gave me this. Also, they gave me this gentle foaming cleanser from Christine Dior. And I already have this and I love it. So that's going to be my backup. What else? Oh, they gave me this nail polish from Dior. And this is in number 226. And that's what I'm wearing on my nails it's like a very nice goldy color what else what else they gave me two of the hd high definition serum like the sample size i really wanted to try this so i'm glad i have the sample so i can test it also they gave me this dior uh, lip gloss and this is in number 692 it's an amazing color very very pigmented and very nice for fall Looks like this, so pretty. Also, they gave me this Clinique uh, Cream Shaper for eyes, and this is a very, very uh, creamy um, pencil from Clinique. What else? Also, they gave me two eyeshadows, and these are in Coffee Brown and Universal Beige. Very nice everyday colors. Also, she gave me this Guerlain eyeshadow in number 143. Very nice um, highlight color. Also, she gave me this Chanel palette. And it's going to be very pretty for fall time. Especially this green shimmery color. What else? Also, she gave me this bracelet from Guess. And just like a black bracelet with a gold heart so pretty and also from clinic she gave me this um, lip liner and this is in plush pink this is in number 07 here's a swatch I don't own any lip liners from clinic so I'm gonna try this and also she gave me this makeup forever like a keychain with a concealer so I can hang it if I'm like doing a client or something and I don't know what I'm going to use this for, but whatever. I have this concealer. This is the HD High Definition Concealer. 
but I have it in a darker color so now I have two this is in number three two five it's a very nice concealer it's a very very nice concealer by the way and last but not least she gave me this Guerlain Aqua Day and this is a refreshener stick looks like this and that's all so that's all I got. Thank you so much Stella for your amazing friendship and for the free stuff and for your help when I was in Italy and for helping my mom when she went to pick the stuff up. And as I said, my mom is in Italy and she's getting me new stuff from Sephora. So I'll, I'll hopefully I'll be doing a new Sephora haul soon. So that's it for me today girls. I hope you enjoyed this kind of haul slash review. And if you have any questions, let me know. I'm going to see you in my next video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. And again, thank you so much, Stella, for everything. See you in my next video. Ciao!